Hello everyone. Happy New Year. Uh, you are in this uh, showroom that Great Pretenders have built in their corporate head office. Because of the pandemic this year, we're not attending any shows. And so we decided that we would build this beautiful showroom. And uh, then we made a video of it. And we are sending that link of the video out to the reps and our customers. And the video is like a real estate video where you walk around and you can zoom in on anything that's new. And there's a tag that will come up, a link, and it'll give you a little description about the item. Those uh, links, I believe they're being sent out today, actually. So um, I'm going to spend uh, the next little while and I'm going to talk about only the things that are new. And I'm defining those things as anything introduced since last July because there have been no trade shows so that those items introduced in July were a pretty soft launch. Um, before we talk about that, I want to talk about the Great Pretenders brand for anyone who's not familiar with it or who's new. Uh, so our promise is um, we always set our goal to make the highest quality product that we can for an affordable price. And so we never design, uh, we never produce a cheap product and we never design something to a price point. We design our products to provide our vision of the Great Pretenders Play, play Experience, which includes durability, um, safety, uh, ease of care, and probably most importantly, comfort and um, size flexibility. So we keep all of those things in mind and we try to provide this high-end product for a reasonable price and it's pretty tricky to do. And how we do it is after years of experience, we've become very familiar with textiles. So by sourcing the correct textile and applying it to the right design, you can create a nice product. A very good example of that is uh, in the toy industry, they have a flammability standard that's quite stringent in North America and in Europe. And uh, to meet that standard, the easy, cheap way of doing it is when you ro uh, order your raw materials, you spray flame retardant on them, whether it's organza or satin or tulle. And the problem with flame retardant, there's a couple problems. One is it washes out. So after a couple of washes, it no longer provides fire protection. So those garments cannot be machine washed. And the second problem is that it causes a reaction on the skin. If it's up around the neck or on the wrists, or it can cause a, a red, a red, a red reaction on the skin, um, almost like an allerg uh, allergic reaction. So Anyhow, so we would never use flame retardant. There are lots of examples where we try and address the issues during the design phase. We um, pay a lot of attention at design and in during production. And as we build our brand, we're getting better and better at understanding. And as we get a little bit bigger, we can order. And now we're actually producing our own um, prints and our own um, fabrics for, for, for us only, uh, which is kind of fun. We have an in-house resident artist who does the artwork for us. Um, anyhow, having said that, I'm going to start off with fairies, and uh, we'll, we'll just look at what's new over here. Uh, we have the Rainbow Sequence Fairy Set. Uh, this is a really beautiful, all of our packaging right now for our dress-ups comes on a header card. This is how the Rainbow Sequence Fairy comes. It has a, um, this is a mesh skirt. Also, why you would buy this is it's glitter free. So there's no glitter shed. You can put this in the wash. This is a foil printed sequence on the skirt. And this is a sequence fabric. It's a four piece wing and it has a satin lining on the back and it comes with a little wand. This is uh, made on a wide piece of soft elastic. So it's quite comfortable. It provides for flexibility and also it, it uh, avoids pinching by using the wide elastic. So this is a $12.50 um, purchase in the US and in Canada. Also, and you can see we have a lot of skirt sets. I can't go through everything in the line today. We have a lot of skirt sets. This is a really strong category for us. Most of them retail for $20, anywhere 20 to 25, depending on the number of pieces and, and the complexity of the design. But they, um, they're really good for someone who doesn't want to stock all the individual components. They just want a whole costume in one set. So they're quite popular. 
Uh, we also have introduced a new category, and I'm going to go through it as we're in each of the different uh, themes. So this is face stickers, and it comes in an elevated package. These stickers have glitter printing, and they have gems, and they go on and off the skin a few times, but they're not really reusable in the long term. They would You could open the pack up, and they could go on and off a few times, and then they would lose their stickiness. They don't leave any residue on the skin. They're completely 100% uh, tested. They're a premium quality face sticker. These are $1.25. Um... In the fairies, so that's in fairies. We also have in fairies uh, wings. We do a lot of business in wings. There's a number of reasons why you would buy our wings. We They're all four-piece instead of two-piece, so a little bit more elaborate. They have chunky glitter on them. Most of the wings are printed on both sides, so you get the effect of the wing from the front when you're wearing it and from the back. Most of the wings have elastic that's covered in satin so it gives extra comfort when they're wearing it and most of the wings are in an organza bag so it's you buy it and it's gift ready for the consumer and they re they wholesale anywhere I think from six dollars to seven fifty or eight dollars depending on the size and the complexity of the wings but they're a very good um, a very good add-on for someone who wants to be a fairy this is our new iridescent fairy dress. Um, this is definitely a dress that's better for, uh, for the little girl where more is better. I definitely had one of those. She couldn't put enough dress up on. And we say that because there are literally a ton of petals. Each petal is gathered and then caught into a skirt that goes all the way around. Um, on the top is this iridescent organza that is edged with an iridescent thread. We have a solid sequence top. It's lined with a really soft knit, um, and it has a sequin strap that, again, is lined with a soft knit and petals on it, and it comes with a halo that has an iridescent ribbon on it. This is packaged on a header card like this and is $17.50. Now, we have just size 5, 6 in this. How we have, what we've done with this design, you'll see the back is very full, it's because we have an elastic the front of this so that it's very soft on their tummies. And we do the size fit by elasticing at the back. By elasticing, we're allowing size flexibility. So if a larger waistline wants to wear this, it'll fit on. So that's the iridescent fairy dress. And then I'm going to do princesses and I'll come back and do mermaids afterwards. This is our new elegant in pink princess dress. She has an illusion sweetheart neckline, but actually that neckline is caught into a spandex mesh fabric, which is the same fabric as the sleeves. This is a four-way stretch pan spandex, so it'll, it'll stretch out and fit quite a large arm, and it won't run or tear very easily, which the organza and the tools, say they, they don't have the durability. This is also a glitter-free dress, so is my iridescent fairy. Um, this is a foil printed sequence that's on the little capelet and that is on the ruffle at the bottom. There's no hoop in the dress. We've done the same thing where we've not gathered the front on this dress so that it will um, it'll lie nice and it will be comfortable for them to wear and you get the flexibility off the back. It comes like this. This is how it would look in your store and this is also $17.50. So that's that dress. Very pretty. For anyone who's paying attention, uh, this is actually a very, very similar to our Luna the Midnight Witch dress, and which we sold out of. And we, it was such a popular one, we thought, okay, well, we'll do it in pink as a princess. Um, I just want to show you, we have the Disney princesses. They all, most of them have a hoop. Anything that has a hoop arrives to you and it, the hoop is tied with a ribbon at the back so it's flat it, it'll go on your it'll, it'll take less space in the store but if they want to show the dress and they undo the elastic then you see the full scale of the dress this is bell what you're noticing here is that this is on a hanger 
right now they don't come this way but we we, we have uh, we're purchasing these hangers and a lot of them and we're going to uh, make them available for people who want a more boutique look in their store they would be able to remove the dress from the header card and put it on one of these hangers um, so that's coming this summer um, this dress is an example of one of our very good sellers this is how it comes flat it's a double hoop dress but they're actually tied up inside and this dress had glitter has glitter on the skirt and it we had some issues with this fabric where it was um, pulling away at seams and fraying away so we supported it with interfacing and and the costs went up and we weren't very happy with it so we have designed a new version of this dress we printed our own fabric which is a heavyweight satin and we know it sews really well we printed it with a foil and then we sequence foil printed the organza it's beautiful and this the price is holding at twenty dollars this is the size seven eight and this is what we're going to be shipping effective july 1st this new style it's not in the catalog so i just wanted to show it to people we also have it in lilac now if we run out of stock of the old style before july 1st we may be shipping some of the new ones ahead of that time but um but we're after july 1st even if we have stock of the old ones we're switching over to this this style this is the lilac version of it which is also a really strong seller uh okay this brings me to my made in canada I have our sequence dresses. These are really quite pretty. They have a glimmer tool on the front, a sequence top, ruffled sleeves, and that is made locally right here at our head office. We have production, and we have a matching cape. And the cape is reversible, and it's satin, and it has a Velcro closure, and it just goes really nicely. And of course, we would have the tiara, and the hats and everything that we have a, a little crown that goes with this so um that's that now i have to talk about our little red riding hood cape capes are an excellent gift and we actually sell a ton of capes because they are not size dependent um they really fit a wide range of physiques so if a, if, a, if a customer doesn't know what to buy because they don't know the size of the child, capes are a really good solution. This is our Little Red Riding Hood cape. It's one of our best sellers. It's a crushed velour. It has spandex in it and a hood. It is a, all of our capes pretty much are a Velcro closure at the neck, which is a, for safety reasons, but also it's easy for children to take them on and off that way this has been really popular so what's new this year is we brought it out in a size 7 8 uh, right here um, many of these capes have been in our line for a long time they're very good sellers but I have to point out this little one also is a made in Canada it's just a I think it's ten dollars it's a, a, a foil iridescent foil knit and it has a marabou around the head and it's just a little glimmer princess cape everything i've shown you is machine washable so um there you go uh okay we'll do mermaids so last year in january we brought out the mermalicious tutu it's been a really successful item for us. It's on a really soft, wide waistband, so it's very comfortable. It's eight layers of different colors of tulle. And then we went for it with the embellishment. We've got this really beautiful um, clamshell and fishtail and starfish and pearls. And it was so we made it was so well done. We we also offered this little headband. Um, same thing, the Mermalicious headband, they're sold separately, they don't come together, and these went very, very well for us. So, we came out with the Mermalicious dress. So, this is the dress. This is an example about the fabrics. We had this fabric made up. It's a five-color print, which gives this moiré effect, and then we used gold glitter thread, um, 
the polyester in the in the fabric to create the shine and then sequins for the sleeves and the top at the back we have hot cut a taffeta to create the fishtail it we only gather the sides of these dresses for size fit we leave the tail and the front and the back flat so that um, the design is for comfort and so that the design works this is 1650 um, in cost new also are our little skirts so we have two of them we have a pink one and a bluey green one these are mermaid skirts on this design we've allowed for the size flexibility we've kept the front of the band flat and we've elasticated the back of a wide elastic to give the size flexibility We've put organza fins on that are edged. Again, this is a weight of organza. We call it crystal organza. It's a really nice quality. Um, and it passes all the flammability without flame retardant. And we bring with this uh, a headpiece. And the headpiece is very deluxe with gems and clamshells and starfish. Um, and that is a $10 wholesale for a Little Mermaid. So it's a pretty good deal. Um... Uh, in this category, of course, we have done mermaid stick-on earrings. It's a bestseller. We brought it out over a year ago. Um, they are a dollar fifty for thirty pair, and then we've added new the mermaid tattoos. All of these are watercolors that our artist did in house, and then we turned them into this artwork. Some of them have glitter on them, uh, and they're a dollar twenty-five. And then we did the nail stickers that are sized for a five-year-old's nail, which is actually quite small. And there's 50 of them on here. And that's $1.15. So it's a really good deal. And they all are packaged so that they'll peg on a wall. So I think that's it for mermaids. Uh, this will bring me over to our rings and tutus. So these rings are new. Um, these are, you get a box like this. This is a bit beat up, but uh, what's nice about these rings, a couple things. A, it's giftable. When you buy it, it's already in a little box. You just wrap it up. It's a, it's a printed enamel, a painted enamel. We have our ring bases are sized for a children's hand, not an adult's. And then they have size flexibility in the bottom. All of the metal components are uh, from a hypoallergenic metal. And all, of course, everything is safety tested, 100% safety tested um, to be compliant. So that's new, and I think these are going to do really well. In the same line, we have the clip-on earrings. And again, it comes just 24. These are a dollar. These are $2. You get butterflies or kitty cats, stars and flowers, already in a box, already giftable, very easy pickup in the store. They're clip-on style. And everything is hypoallergenic. Um, I have to talk about our dolls. I had my granddaughter here when we were setting up the booth just before Christmas. And she's four and a half. A uh, little Lucy. And um, I said, you know, if you'll let us make a video of you, you could have whatever you want. And so, no question, what she wanted was this doll. Okay, Evie the Unicorn. And I have to show you how beautiful this doll is. When we designed the doll, we designed it so that the body has a printed cotton. Um, that's to make it look like it has clothing on, it's not naked. We have a really pretty iridescent mesh, removable skirt, and a fur jacket, which Velcro's on and off. Uh, she has a beautiful tail, very soft, strongly put on, and a beautiful mane. And she, machine washable, $10 cost for Evie. Now we have done these little dolls in many themes. So we've got ballerinas, mermaids, fairies, and superheroes. We've got Betty the Batgirl, and she's got a beautiful cape. Everything is embroidered down, a nice print. And we've got the superhero here. I think Alice the superhero, or Susie the superhero, with her little outfit, very sweet. So those are our dolls, are all the same price. Um, we have these four new purse sets. They are uh, $4 uh, in Canada and the US. They have a Velcro closure on them. 
They have a really, we have unicorn. And this strap is sized to fit a five-year-old. It's not going to hang down to their knees. Um, we've got four themes, unicorn, star, poodle, and bunny. And we introduced these in July. And the star and the unicorn are the top performers, but not very far behind are the poodle and the bunny. So they're not too far behind. Uh, also, while we're in rings, I have to tell you that these first stone rings are a top seller for us. They're 80 cents. It's 24 in a pack, and they sell very well. In our tutus, I have to talk about these because they're made in Canada. Again, we put them on a really soft, wide elastic, eight layers of tulle, and um, it's all machine washable. It's 100%. This tulle is actually manufactured in the United States. Uh, we do two sizes, a four through six, and we do a baby size. And the baby size is just for that mom who wants to have a selfie done with her newborn or even just take a picture of her, of her little baby uh, wearing a tutu. And we have the bunny. And I have to show you this because a lot of people don't know the bunny's tail comes off. Uh, if you want. And he comes with a headband and again eight layers of tulle and everything is felt. The flowers, he's really sweet. But what's new in this collection is the rose petal skirt. Um, this is really beautiful. It is three layers of tulle gathered with the flowers dispersed. It's a uh, satin taffeta at the waistband, not gathered in the front, but gathered in the back to give the size flexibility. And that one is 1250. It goes really well with the um, golden rose petal cape, as you can see. And then you could put a um, bodysuit with that, which I'll show you later. I think that's it for this category. So I'm going to move over here to careers. So careers has been a great category for, uh, we've done it for a long time, longer than most people know. And uh, we've always had some, uh, you know, there's a, Melissa and Doug kind of own this market and they sell to everybody and it's a lot of people have said, oh, I've got Melissa and Doug, I don't want to. But where we do get it in, people, it sells very well and they like it and eventually they just stop buying Melissa and Doug. Our fabric quality is a higher quality. Our designs are a little bit better. We 100% stand behind the product. Our new item this year is the vet. We designed this print in house. He comes with pants and a shirt. He's got a, a name tag, a mask, a syringe, and a, and a stethoscope, but he also comes with a puppy who's not feeling very well, so he has a cone, and that cone can come off. Okay, so that's our little puppy. Um, this entire set is uh, packaged in all of them in a garment bag, and it would look something like this. I think we have quite a few themes now, and we're working on two more to launch, hopefully this summer. Um, but we have the fireman and the construction worker and the astronaut and the policeman and the pilot and the two doctors. We have a green doctor and a pink doctor. I tried to remove the pink doctor, but everyone shouted at me and I had to put it back in the line. So we now have two doctors. Um, so that's the careers line. I think there's a lot of opportunity with careers right now. From what I'm hearing from people, uh, we've certainly had picked up a lot of new accounts who just want to carry the careers. So there's a, a good opportunity in careers right now. Here we have our color a costume section. We developed this idea about five years ago. We started with the princess cape. It's still one of the best sellers. It, it's just a, 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 a twill fabric that we've got a special printing process because it helps prevent bleed. The cape is reversible and it comes with six water-based markers. Now, you can use any marker with this cape and people ask, can you wash it? And yes, most of the markers wash out 100%, but the, the neon orange leaves a little bit of color in the cape afterwards. And we thought about not putting the neon in, but it's such a great color and I, I couldn't make the compromise, especially because I know that this cape takes a long time for someone to color in. And when it's colored in, they really don't want it washed out. They want to wear it. They don't want to wash it out. So um, 
So that's this line. These capes sell for $11. What's new is we did our round the world cape. This color is the ocean color. This color is the color inside and it goes from end to end on the globe, starting in the Pacific Ocean up to North American, Iceland, uh, down to the Antarctic. You've got Europe and Africa, Australia, Sub-Asia, with all the icons on it. So it's educational and it's fun and it's quite successful. It sells very well. Also, we have, that's new, is the Ladybug Cape. This we just launched in January. It's a full circle cape. Uh, you color in all the things that a ladybug might find and it's reversible so you can wear it on this side if you don't want to look at your colored inside. It comes with four markers and stays at the price of $12.50. We also have the dragonfly. This is brand new. So it has the body down the back and these two wings that you color in and the design is so that the wings come off the back there is an elastic at the bottom of the wings to catch their finger in so that they can fly with the wings. And the really cool thing about this is we've used a really iridescent organza for the other side of the wings. And in the light, it really does look like a dragonfly wing, so it's pretty cool. Uh, this is also $12.50. We, we've been selling it for a couple, I don't know, six weeks now. The dragonfly is... Uh, doing very well. It's slightly ahead of the ladybug, but they're both selling quite well. Um, people ask us, you know, why do you have these ones hanging and some in boxes? And the truth is that when we introduced this line, I did, people would say, well, do I, uh, I don't know, like would I put this in my craft section or would I put this in my, um, uh, uh, my costume section? And I didn't really know the answer to that question. So I, the people who wanted it for the craft section said, well, it has to be in a box. So we boxed two styles. We boxed the uh, butterfly and we boxed the superhero. And you can see it, butter, the butterfly is one of our best sellers in the category. But, um, but people, I also boxed some of the small capes and people didn't want that. So some people still like it to be hanging. So the skirts and the aprons, and the capes are all in hanging, and I just have these two styles in a box. It's a little bit more expensive to get the box sets. Um, maybe adds about a dollar or a dollar fifty to the cost. Next category here is unicorns. Now, you know, it's bewildering. Unicorns still have legs. That's our experience. We have the baby unicorn cape and the toddler unicorn cape that is made in Canada. Very beautiful. A lot of people wanted a larger size, so we have brought out size 5.6 and size 3.4 this year in this cape uh, with the same beautiful mane on the back. The only difference is that this is lined. Um, so that's the unicorn. And again, we have these new items in the unicorn. We have the nail stickers, 50 sets again at $1.15. We have the watercolored artwork for the um, tattoos, temporary tattoos, 18 pieces for $1.25. We have the unicorn uh, face stickers, which are gems and glitter printed face stickers for $1.25. And a bestseller is the unicorn stick on earrings. And these are $1.50 and you get 30 pairs. So that is um, new in unicorn. Uh, I didn't talk about this, but I should. We we brought out bodysuits a year ago. We have them in size 3, 4, and 5, 6. They are made from a two-way spandex poly fabric that has an iridescent uh, coating on it. So everything is cover stitch, so built to last just like a ballet one would be. The threads won't break all the openings. A $5 cost. So it's a really nice way to complete an outfit and add on to an order for a consumer. Uh, okay, I th oh yeah, one more, birthday, birthday girl. Okay, I had to put this in with party. She's $15, she's a two piece set and it's just what it says, it's a birthday girl. So this is a size three, four, a little bit younger market, machine washable. Um, 
two years ago, we decided that, you know, the average person going in to buy one of our dress ups was often buying a birthday gift to attend a party or buying a birthday gift because they were hosting a party. And we thought, wouldn't it be nice if we could provide a real nice selection of high street quality party favors that were at really good prices. And so that's what we did. And we brought out the unicorn set and it did very well. And this year what's new is we brought out happy birthday, generic happy birthday. So what, this is again, all of our artwork, all of our design done in house here in Sarnia, Ontario. Um, we try to make differences between what's out there by the shape, by using mylar prints and by the quality of the actual piece that we're using. Um, so we offer napkins and of course the packaging is nice, right? There's your eight cups in a package, very good price. And we did the garland to go with this. And here's what the garland looks like. And that is a $2.50 cost. So a very nice little add-on. It has a very specialty feel to it. Um, we're selling a lot of candles. Uh, they're themed to match in with the different uh, categories. Now I couldn't walk away from this section without talking about the rhinestones. And I'll show you one of these. Um, these are beautiful rhinestones. They peg, they have a little cut in them. I have the numbers zero through nine. They're sold in packs of four. I think they're $1.25. Uh, what's really great about these is they open a lot of doors. So it's not, yeah, you can sell it in a toy store, but this sells in a cake shop. It sells in a wedding store. We had a wedding chain pick up just the rhinestone numbers and the chandeliers. Uh, we had the, um, it sells in gift and apparel. Uh, so there is just a lot of, in any kind of lifestyle store, uh, bookstores, you know, um, do very well with the rhinestone. It really goes through a lot of doors. So, uh, and we have the display and it's free when it's loaded. Well, I now have to show you our dinosaur section. Dinosaurs are a um, big category for us. Ours are quite special. This is a beautiful fabric that's embossed with a scale print of a uh, dinosaur reptile. And it's a very soft velour. And these fabrics are hand dyed. Um, it has a stuffed head like this with very realistic looking eyes, machine washable. Um, so we do get variation in the color, and, but I think that's what makes it special. So you just have to go with what you get. This red guy was very popular, so we brought him out in brown. Uh, we're also a really good seller. We have our T-Rex, uh, similar, very T-Rexian. And we have a pterodactyl. And we did the red one in a baby size. And we did our uh, green one in a baby size. After that, we introduced Toothless from How to Train Your Dragon. He's got beautiful blue eyes and scales down his back. And he's also hand dyed, so sometimes his fabric looks a little bit brown. Sometimes it looks blue. Um, that's what we get. And then that was such a good seller, we brought out this guy. And he's kind of a teal. And he's glitter free. This is not glitter, it is a foil print on here with all of his scales all stitched and turned. Um, he's been very, very successful for the price of uh, $14. I'm going to just grab my glasses, okay? So coming right off that, we come into wizards and knights and dragons. And you are going to see here our new galaxy cloak. So this cloak, we designed this print in our head office here and produced the fabric. And then we um, used a lot of fabric. It's gathered quite fully all the way around because it's so much fabric. We put slots in the side for the arms to come out. It's fully lined. It's a size 5.6. It's $15, which is a really great price. And we, it's, we've had some shipments on it this year. And it was a really great response. Uh, and people are asking for a size 7.8. So we are bringing this out in a size 7.8. Probably this August it'll be here. Because um, it trends up a little bit. 
We also have uh, the new Glimmer Dragon Knight Reversible. This is a really nice fabric, a two-way color. So it's green blue. On the other side, it's silver for the night. And it has a beautiful mask that's lined in felt, so it's quite soft on the face. And this is $16. No glitter, and it is um, machine washable. Uh, it's also, we, we've had this little reversible night cape in our line forever. We made a running change. We added a hood. Um, so a night hood on one side, a dragon on the other. Uh, so now it ships like this uh, for my, don't know the price. I'm going to say it's $12.50. Um, we also have dinosaur rings. I just want to talk about these. They're highly detailed. They're made from a polymer um, that, and the design is that like this. So they have, you just push on them here and you can widen that ring to fit a bigger finger. So it could go all the way on and now I can wear that, okay? Um, they come, I think there's 24 in a case and um, I find if you sit them up on the side, that they will sell better. Uh, there's six designs and they're a buck. And we sold these to the Smithsonian a couple years ago and uh, they move an astonishing amount of these. So they're pretty, pretty good uh, sell through on them. Now we have our, our polymerized rubber. These new um, crowns ship flat like this. So they come to you like this and you can just hang them up like that or you they have size and flexibility built in on this adjustment or you can set them up and put them on a shelf like that beside them. They're five dollars. They've sold really well. I have them in silver and in gold and they match really well with our um, polymerized rubber swords and shields. As you can see many of these are in our top seller range. Uh, they, they do really really well. The EVA is a little friendlier because it doesn't, uh, it's more flexible. We use a 50 pound density EVA. Most people in the market use a 30 or 40. We have multiple layers. We use a closed cell so we get a really nice print job. We add gems. They're $5. Uh, we have our new dragon one. On the shields, we're using a 70 pound EVA so it's quite rigid. We grommet in the straps that are adjustable with Velcro. And then you've got your shield and it's six fifty. Um, so lots of fun. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do that now. So this is baby capes. There's nothing new in here. Pirates, same old, same old. Uh, we come down here and we're into uh, party. So this was our party line that we launched a couple years ago, and this year we launched a softer colorway on this. So a little more pink. And this is our superhero. It's new as of January. We tried to uh, differentiate by using Mylar prints. We have a pink metallic print on here. And by the shape. And um, people have said, oh, is that strong enough? I mean, maybe it's too heavy. And I say, no, this is not too heavy. And here, there. So that works. So that's our plate and this is how it packages so in order to prevent damage in shipping it comes on a background like that we have the cups 20 napkins eight cups eight plates we've got the matching candles and we did tattoos and these I don't think you can see it but there's a lot of glitter on them they're a dollar 25 um, put this back all right of course, we had to do an outfit to match. So you see these outfits right here. Um, this is a tutu set. It has a reversible face mask, a reversible cape, and a tutu. And this tutu elastics at the waist. It has a metallic crinkle taffeta for the underlayer of the skirt. There is no glitter on this. It is 100% foil print. This is foil printed on. And it's a Velcro closure at the neck. It's all machine washable and it's $15. And it matches beautifully with this set. But we also introduced last July the teal and copper one, which is a very trendy colorway. It has the same details. It has the crinkle taffeta underskirt. It has the foil print tool. 
and the foil print uh, mesh, and then the elastic heated uh, waistband and the reversible cape. $15. It also goes really nicely with this as a colorway. Um, also $15. Then if someone was hosting a party and they were doing superheroes, we brought out these new superhero rings. They're enamel, size adjustable, all superhero icons and 75 cents. So they're a really nice treat for a uh, loot bag. Um, and we did superhero hero stick on earrings, 30 pairs for $1.50. Very nice. We did superhero nail stickers, $1.15 for 50 of them. And we have gems and whatever. And then we did superhero tattoos. I don't know if you can see all the glitter on those. Uh, $1.25 for 18 tattoos. They're pretty cute. Uh, and we did face stickers for the superheroes. We did a spider and a Batman. And uh, these have glitter on them too. It's harder to see. And gems, but you... There's really good pictures of these in the catalog. They're $1.25. So again, a very nice add-on for a party. So that's kind of a shot of all the different stickers and tattoos. They have, there's Dragon and Dino up there too. Um, one last thing I should mention uh, in Superhero is our tunic. So this tunic opens at the side and it goes on over the head. And it's been designated as a SNAP product, which is special needs adaptable product, which um, for a child that is physically disabled or in a wheelchair or maybe even just uh, has a weight issue, this could go on and it just ties at the side to makes it very easy for them to take on and off. Um, so we have super hair. We also have tunic styles available in other um, themes like fairy and princess. And we have the same thing for boy here. It just goes on over your head and the cape hangs down the back and it has a mask. One way it's Superman, the other way it's Batman. Very clever. Um, so we've got that. All right, now you're looking at our classic jewelry collection. We introduced this quite a while ago. This is a 72 peg stand and it has six tiers. Each tier has 12 uh, pegs on it, and each peg holds 12 items. So I think it's holding 850 plus pieces on this stand. Uh, if you keep it fill and well maintained, you could sell up to four times. You could turn this four times in a year. We have customers that have done that. Um, it, uh, an average buy-in, most of the things on this sell for between a dollar twenty-five and maximum maybe two seventy-five or three. Uh, there's no one that has this range. I don't think diverse in a, a range of product at these prices. It's very very sharp pricing, and uh, many 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 styles to choose from. Now we have some standard planograms for two popular put-ups, but some people like to pick and choose. So we've just kind of highlighted what our best sellers are. This is a share and tear where you rip it off and give one to your best friend. Um, and you can see here what's new. Um, if this is too big of an investment for your customer, we have it in a 36 peg stand and in a 24, which you can see right here. And they sell well, the 36 sells well, but not as good as the 72. Um, but it does sell well. So if someone doesn't want to make the big investment, then... And we have the 24 as well. You can see it here. Um, it's also quite popular for people who just want a smaller presence. On here is a, just a quick pan shot of everything that's new in classic jewelry. Um, so far, the superhero is trending really, really well. I'm pretty confident Butterfly's Best Friends is going to be big, and so will Tassels. This is brand new, just arrived in some of these pieces. So that's our classic jewelry line. Um, on the back wall here, we have our um, boutique jewelry. So the classic jewelry line is designed for ages, we say three through eight, but it's really strong on three through five or six. So with our boutique, we tried to go just a little bit older, maybe five through eight, five through nine, something like that. It's a little more elevated in design. This is the display 
that one is up against the wall too far. You can see here the display turns and you have four facings, one for earrings, necklaces and bracelets. And this is headbands and snap clips. And this is the same thing and the same thing. Now, we introduced this last um, July and it's done very, very well. Everything on this is double strung so that it's a little bit stronger except for something that's on seed beads because they're too small to get two strands through. So for instance, this is too small to be double strung and so is the fine one on here. So, uh, and we try to theme it so that if you bought this and this, you'd be able to find earrings and snap clips that match. Uh, on the displays that we have coming in, this bottom tray has been made into a drawer so you can pull it out and get at and see the ones in the back because there's some really cute ones back here, but you can't see them. There's our little seashell, for instance, okay. Um, anyhow, there's a lot of nice styles in here. And we introduced this and we said originally, you can only buy these items if you take the display, because I wanted to see the effect of having a display, a solid display of our product. And some people didn't like that and they complained but they took it and wherever it went in, it was really quite successful. It's a quite, a, I've had even an account today I was speaking with and they said it's a nice small stand. It's very compact and it does very well in their store. We threw in some little tiny mini wands at a really good price, uh, just to put on the top of the display here. Um, now in January, we're allowing people to buy just the SKUs and not take the display if they want. Um, in which case they should know it won't display on the traditional racks. They would have to get some jewelry displays, something like this. I know many of them have that, but you can see we're trying to show how you would display this line if you, um, if you bought it without the display. And I'd really hate to see this on our stands. It just wouldn't look very good. Uh, it's such a nice thing, all of it. Oh yeah, here is our best seller here. Um, and you can see we finish all of our ends on our headbands with either a bead or with a uh, fabric tie off of ribbon or something so there's no metal ever poking into your head on any of our headbands. So yeah, there you go. So that's um, the total presentation. If anyone has any questions about this, you can call our customer service or me or um, Visha or Kim, and I would be happy to answer any questions that you have. Uh, we 100% stand behind our line. We're not perfect when we make a mistake. We absolutely uh, fix it, uh, whatever that may be. And, um, you know, uh, we really try to stand behind our line. We really believe in it. And I hope you guys uh, uh, will have a very successful year with it. That's Happy New Year and I uh, look forward to seeing you guys in 2022.